Good morning, Southeast Polk Junior High. It's Mrs. Armitrad again from the library. It's that time of year where I'm perusing the um, mystery and the horror supernatural sec um, selections sections of our library to look for a good book to read around Halloween time. And this is a new book that we just got in from Scholastic. It's called Creep by Erin Corrigan. It is a rather sophisticated thriller versus kind of a horror. One of those books that keep you reading from chapter to chapter because you just can't wait to see what happens. Let's read a little bit about the premise of the story. Olivia is curious about the people moving into 16 Olcott Place. The last family there moved out in the dead of night. And the new family, the Donahues, have no idea why. Olivia becomes fast friends with Janie Donahue, so she's at the house when the first of the letters arrive. This book is not just scary, but sassy too. And I want to read a, just a short sassy part of it that I enjoyed. Janie's smile broke through in, into fits of giggles. I'm sorry. Sometimes I like to scare my mom and make her think I'm more like my brother Ben than my sister Lucy. They're twins, but She's a valedictorian, and he's a sociopath. Janie, honestly, her mom shook her head. I told you to stop calling your sister a valedictorian. But here's a scary passage. Who are you, intruder? I keep watch. I see the lights turn on, then off. I know when you're sleeping when the children are not asleep. Beneath the floorboards are bones. I hear them singing from the road. When you walk, know that there are bones beneath your feet. Soon your bones will join them. This is one of those books, Sinister, keeps you reading from chapter to chapter to the very end. You might be up late at night, the only one awake in the house, trying to finish it and wondering what or who creep is. Remember to send your book requests, your book reservations to us in the library, and we will get those processed to you very quickly. And you can swing in and pick them up. So we'll hope to hear from you soon.